Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. So today we have been to Poundland, haven't we? Yeah. And where else? Uh, I can't remember. B&M. Mm. So this is my little helper for today. My little lily pops and obviously I'm Victoria. And let's go on with it. I'm going to start off with the Poundland stuff, which is mainly food. So do you want to grab something? Mm. Oh, it's Okay. That was mine. We just grab both of them. Just grab both of them. So we picked up some pick and mix pots, didn't we? So Lily's got one. Can you show? No, don't open it. You don't, you don't need to see the contents. So we've got one each. You're going to show it over to the camera? These might be the wrong way around, but yeah, we've got one each. Yeah, this one's hers and this one's mine and we just did a random pick and mix of all the sweets they had there, didn't we? Mm -hmm. I'm going to put them over there so I can put them away. Right, do you hold these? Now these, you get hold them up. These aren't actually a quid, these are £2, but they are the Cookie and Cream Kit Kat and you get 16 bars in there, so that will keep us going for a while. Sadly, she can't have them in her lunchbox, but then she can have them when she gets home or we can have them as like a snacky at night. And yeah, Liam chucked them in the basket, so hey. <laughs> then we've also got some more chocolate as in these Cadbury's Time Out wafer bars. These are my favourite. I absolutely love these. Um, I used to try and stick to one at night because I'm trying to sort of watch what I eat at night. And this is usually my pudding. So one of these will do me for the night for my little sweet treat. Hey, you like your ice cream at the moment, don't you? Mm -hmm. I would say lastly on the food front and chocolate front, but if not, Liam picked up a bag of munchies. These are not my thing. Um, but he likes them, so he picked up a bag of those for him for munchies. Oh, Liam's got a new bot bottle for school. Um, I think I mentioned in one of my latest. Yeah. <laughs> in one of my latest uh, like grocery hauls that like everyone's getting a bit worn out after a year of school so I picked up this it's got a I dog got made it. out of fruit so it's got kiwis grapes apples blueberries bananas it's super cool Helps. it was only a quid um so we let, let her pick that up then last on the food front is bag of monster munch these are Liam's favourite crisps, so you just grab those because they're a quid and obviously they're more expensive in other shops. Now, he also picked up some uh, clipper fluid for his Zippo lighters, I assume it's for them. We'll leave it in the bag for the moment because it needs to be washed, darling. So he picked this up on the way out because they have them right at the entrance or the exit sort of area. Um, and he's been meaning to get this for so long. So I'm kind of glad he picked up a bottle of it, and now he'll be able to use his Zippo's that me and Lily have brought him over the years, eh? And lastly from Poundland, this is what we have been wanting for a long time. Lily accidentally broke our last one, didn't you? Obviously completely accidental, she knocked it off the side, and it smashed. I've knocked it off so many times and it's not broken, so we just picked up another oil burner, or we use wax melts in this. So obviously you put the wax melt in here, a little tea light in here, and your house smells amazing. And this was, they had two different colours in. They had this blue and they had a red left. I have no idea what other colours, but we were actually hoping to change our living room to a teal and a grey. So I thought this would go quite well with a teal slash grey, sort of bluey colour, hopefully. When it's done, it'll look all pretty and it'll go together. But I can't wait to start burning wax belts again because they smell amazing. And that's everything we got from Poundland, and it all together came to £10. Right, so I have no idea where that cut off, so we're going to start the B&M section again. Um, we, as I said in the last clip, Lily's lunchbox is done. Oh my god. Sorry about the noise outside. Um, Lily's lunchbox is a bit worn out, and it doesn't smell very pretty anymore. So we let her pick this, a new lunchbox, and you picked... My Little Pony, and it has butterflies, rainbow, ponies, so it's Twilight Sparkle, um, rainbow dash pink pie. And it's got the My Little Pony t tag, I believe it is like a licensed thing. Yep. 
um, and obviously it was only four ninety nine. where Tesco charged like 5 to £10, pounds, no 7 to £10 pounds for their lunch boxes and it's a nice size one. So best fit everything in there, including her bottle, her bottle have to go in this one. But it's an insulated one and you couldn't pass up a five for a lunchbox and Tesco tried to charge double the price. Hey, mm -hmm. you happy with your new lunchbox? Yeah. Right, that one that bit might be a bit heavy. So we picked up this fairy fabric conditioner. Um we've actually got a new washing machine today, finally, after four days of being without one. Oh my god. Um so obviously we're gonna be going through quite a bit of this to catch up on the washing. This has got 83 washes in, apparently, and it was £3.99, but obviously this size should last us quite a while anyway, so £3.99 is not too much to spend. And it smells good, and it's fairy, so it's like a good brand. And it's going to make our clothes smell nice. Yeah, high five. I'll give you a kiss instead. I picked up some of these. I like them. How do you know? You've not even tried them. Yeah, I tried them at Grandma's. No, you didn't. No, they're not what you think they are. I want some. <laughs> these are salt and vinegar fish and chip sticks. I love these, and these were down to 50p, so it was 10p a bag. Bargain. And I haven't had these in so long. I nearly thought it was something else, but I also love the packaging. It looks like a little newspaper. Which is really sad, but hey. Um, so yeah, I picked up some of these. Lily saw these, which are the milk straws. Now, if you've not heard of milk straws or the magic sippers, they make your milk taste amazing. We have tried cookies, haven't we? Chocolate, banana, strawberry. Yeah. Any others? Uh, I'm not sure. Um, bubble gum. And chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, and chocolate chip cookies. And what ones did you pick this time? Do you remember? And fruit. Fruit ones. Oh! Oh no! We picked all of them. I think so. Oh, let me see what that one is. Oh, 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 we are. Oh, oh that's a bit, that's, that's quite handy. Mommy, can we get... So it's actually got five of four different flavours in. So it's got... Jammy biscuits, um, chocolate chocolate ones like chocolate Oreo biscuits. So it's got um, like jam biscuits, chocolate biscuits, fruity cereal like the American cereal, I suppose, and forest fruit, sour cherry, and banana flavour in one. That sounds a bit cool, doesn't it? Look, like it's that. called a wizard. A wizard sipper because it's got three different colours in a row. Should we have a quick look? It comes in this milk carton packaging, which I think is super cute. Um, let's, let's have a look. In here. I want to see all of them. Oh, wow. Oh, no, 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 no. Right. So I take it this is like the Oreo flavour. Oh, what the chocolate biscuit flavour. Mm. Then. Oh, my God. Oh my god. I have no idea what this one is, but it looks cool. It's like chocolate and strawberry. Fruity. Fruity flavours. And this is the wizard one. Uh, and that's, I take it that's the fruit cereal. So that's kind of handy and they come in their own storage, which I'm is perfect. Sure, okay, should I finish up them? Yeah. So Liam also picked up a monster because he is kind of addicted. And I picked up two of these, which were two for a pound because it is very warm out there and we were very warm after shopping we also did head to tesco right i hope you really enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up so it's a little bit crazy and a bit messy but i just wanted to get it done before i put it all away and forget about it um yeah give it a thumbs up if you liked it and i'll see you again very very soon bye